We call that in Canada, it's LCV. 50, 53 and a 40 footer. Oh, this, this is not 53? No, that's a 40 footer. You can only pull 106 from bumper to bumper in, in North Dakota. Oh, okay. So, bad bumper in front of the track. But I think it's only North Dakota, right? They have the double, right? Yeah, North Dakota and South Dakota. Oh, the, the same this one? Yep, Minnesota doesn't. Oh, but we call this one in Canada, it's LCV. Okay. Long combination vehicle. Yep. Ako ako ng Nebraska today. Hindi rin ako makakalayo ng Nebraska dahil from here all the way hanggang border ng Nebraska around 8 hours. So hindi rin, ma hindi rin ako makakatawin from Nebraska all the way hanggang Kansas. So late na ako mag-start. Ba't ang iniisip ko ngayon? Itong tulay dito sa minor I'm not sure kung you the one to love is more Ito yung sinasabi kong tulay
this. There you go. Stop sign. Ah, lili ko na ko dun sa unahan. Papuntang I-94 din. Meron pang dalawang tulay na aking dadaanan. I think merong nag PM sa akin or nag-comment from Bismarck, isang Pilipino. Shout out sa iyo, kabayan. Nakalimutan ko na kung sino ka. Ah, oh, sakit sa likod, guys. Sakit sa likod. Oh. Ano ang flag ng Amerika? Anyways, yeah, almost there. Five hours more. Almost six hours. Kita niyo yung nagbe-blink na yan Pwede kang mag-cross dyan anytime when it's safe to do so Okay Hindi mo priority yun Pwede ka lang mag-change Basta clear Yung Incoming na sasakyan Minimum of 45, why? No, I'm not talking to you. Sige, glam-lam siya. Okay, mo niya akong ganyan guys. So, tingin ko live ah. Sige, may tulay dito. sa katulay oh still on wala ko lang kasi medyo mababa dito sa side oh kinagabahan ako Oh my 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 Taas na ng konti Kaya hindi na ako magmi-minor Yes! Success! But, bago ko kakanan sa 83 Pawash room muna ako Take a break, check and track, check and load. Kasi pagdating ko dun, pagkakanan ko dun sa pupuntahan ko na kalsada, wala na, walang restroom na ganyan. So paano pag, uy may LCB din pala sila dito. North Dakota. Yeah, meron silang LCB 
LCB, LCB. Okay. I never thought that there's a LC. What do you call that one here? What's that? This one. What do you call that one? They call it a paper? No, no. I mean the two trailers. Oh, the doubles? Are the doubles? Yep. Ah, we, we call that in Canada, it's LCV. 50, 53 and a 40 footer. Oh, this, this is not 53? No, nope, that's a 40 footer. You can only pull 106 from bumper to bumper in, in North Dakota. Oh, okay. So, back bumper in front of the But I think it's only North Dakota, right? They have the doubles, right? Yeah, North Dakota and South Dakota. Oh, the, the same this one? Yep, Minnesota does it. Oh, but we call this one in Canada, it's LCV. Okay. Long combination vehicle. Yep, I uh, think they just call it doubles here. But Do you have a permit for this one? If you will, just, uh, just uh, a doubles endorsement, doubles and triples. Oh, I see, I see. It's a regular CDL with a doubles and triples endorsement. Oh, okay, yeah. So. Yeah, because the first time I see this one here in North Dakota. Yeah, but they don't have super video here, right? No, nope. the super video. No. All right. Well, they're talking about it, but they didn't pass it. I didn't like it. <laughs> I don't. A lot of guys don't like it. The wind hurts. Oh, it's so with the wind because they're both empty now. So with the wind, it kind of. So it's, it, it's not hard pulling this one during winter time here. Yeah, it is in the winter, but when they're full, they're okay. But when they're empty with the wind and the icy roads, they blow around. Because most of the time in Canada, if you have the LCB, yep. these are the prone for accident. Yep. Because yep. sometimes this one is not heavy; it's light yep. inside, light. And that's no traction. That's we used to pull them. They used to pull them backwards, so the was in the front, oh, okay. everyone was in the back. Oh, okay. We ditched enough that they finally got us 53 foot foot up the middle of the back. So it's easier, but it's still not fun. <laughs> okay, have a nice day. So, ang tawag nila, doubles, hindi siya sa Canada, LCB, long combination vehicle. Mushroom na ako. Okay. La. Chiko lang. mamaya wala na akong titigil mamaya dahil sa lubong na yung kalsada pag mo lang siya once na medyo feel mo na yes, tight yan okay pag may tunog tight yan tight Sakto lang siya sa 8 hours but bitin ah Sakto siya sa 8 hours pero bitin siya sa 8 hours Parang ganun Kaya yung drone Yung drone hindi ni Hindi ko pra yung drone Dahil malakas ang hangin sa taas Kita kita niya kita niya kita niya uwak Anyway yeah let's go guys Welcome back to the channel So nandito ko ngayon sa 1804 South Detour ng aking load Dahil medyo mataas ng konti So napakaganda ng lake I'm not sure kung nakikita ninyo Yep But uh, makakuha tayo ng view pagdating dun sa unahan you know? Kung hindi lang ako nagmamadali today Dahil dapat yung aking cross ng Nebraska ay tomorrow morning But yung aking pilot 
gusto niya mag-cross today I don't know, maybe bukas ay meron pa siyang ipapilot ulit Kaya kailangan makakross kami ng Nebraska State all the way hanggang Kansas Pero kung wala sana, sarap sana ng tumigil Yan no, may mga parking area dito and then drone shots Kasi yun talagang expectation ko Titigil ako sa border ng state line border ng South Dakota and Nebraska tonight Meron sana akong enough na time para to take a shot ng mga lugar na aking dinadaanan ngayon At sana makita nyo rin sana true drone yung mga shots na yun Yan sana oh, <coughs> may parking area Uh, anyway, try natin dito na makakuha ng kahit hindi shots, yung ano lang, yung view through GoPro 2-4 daming dito nandito na side doon ah uh, parang electric ano ba yun? may dam anong tawag dyan? napukor kinokontrol nila yung flow ng lake pababa dito sa ano sa hydro dam ganda oh saan ito? sa North Dakota Ah, no, I mean, sorry, South Dakota guys South Dakota ito Close There you go, ganda no Pag nakakotse ka, pwede kang bumaba dun sa wala pinaka ground dito bawal kang tumigil walang parking area wala drive thru ka lang talaga pero hindi siya dagat ha lake lake siya lake uh, ohay lake ohay something like that sound like that you make my eyes all see all the crazy Hey guys, nandito ako ngayon sa I-90 westbound ng South Dakota Ang lakas ng hangin Look, kita mo yung gantina Hindi ako makabuilo kanina pa Yung speed ko lang ay 49 miles an hour Hindi na dito ha Kikita mo sa antina o oh. oh. Sa lubong yung hangin Kaya hindi ako makakahataw Yan lang talaga pinaka top speed ko 48 miles per hour So, nandito na ako sa Mordo Saskatchewan, ah, Saskatchewan South Dakota Mordo, South Dakota Medyo may kasikipan lang tong Truck stop nila dito Maliit lang siya na Flying J Pilot 
Wala pa ako nakitang labs. Hindi pa ako nakapag-refuel sa labs. Kasi kahapon na ako nag-start ng drive. So ilan lang yung spots dito. Masikip to ng konti. Ay ay ay, may pila pa. Money siya karon. Oh, may pila pa. Hindi. Yun lang. Dito lang ako nalungkot. yung pag ano niya pag pilot niya let's go guys 83 so meron ba akong isang oras alas 4 Kalsada guys Walang kalaban sa highway Dahil route ko to So ngayon medyo nakakatakbo na ako Nang 60 miles an hour Dahil yung hangin galing dun sa west Sa lubong papunta ng East Ito papunta ng south So Sa lungat ko yung hangin ngayon No? Bundok pero walang mga puno May puno pala pero maliit
Bruno Tui. Nebraska guys, Nebraska.
Guys, ito yung town ng Valentin, Nebraska. County Historical Society Museum. I'll see you in uh, 30 minutes before sunrise tomorrow. Uh, yeah. 
uh, we'll start on 30 minutes before sunrise so we can uh, reach uh, Kansas early in the morning. Sounds good. Yeah, so we'll start tomorrow uh, before sunrise. Okay. So we can finish early. Yeah, that'll be my stepdad. Your stepdad? Yeah. Oh, I see. It's same company and everything. He's not going to charge anything else or anything like that, so I'll just let him do the paperwork. And then, because uh, he does all the billing and stuff anyway, so I, I already let him know. I'm just supposed to let him know where I parked at. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. So he'll be here. Uh, he's the one that did the route survey. Okay, so. thank you so much. Yep. Thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, thank you. Alam nyo na guys kung ano yung mga paboritong spot, di ba? Kung kanakol na madala sa Midigil, pag oversize yung load. Usual sa gilid-gilid. Binibigyan ko lang sila ng space para pag ikot nila, merong enough space na makapag-torn. Aray! O, oh, di ba? Safe ako dito, makakaliko sila. Then, makakaikot din yung mga truck. Hindi ako nakakapag-obstruct Hindi ako nakaka-obstruct sa kanilang Turning radius Sorry ba? Enough na space Wala akong kompetensya Magpa-under man ako ng ETO And it's all good Walang problema Wala nang tatabi sa akin Tama lang talaga ano. Kaya paborito ko tong spot Dito sa labs Anyway Tataposin ko na ang video I know, napakahaba na ng video Maka pinagsasabi ko, pinakita ko sa inyo Papahinga lang ako saglit And then Shower, of course Sa loves Namiss ko yung shower ng loves I don't know if yung points ko ay Okay pa yung points ko Pero for sure, babalik siya sa zero Hindi siya unlimited Kailangan ko mag-refuel ulit Kailangan ko mag-refuel ulit sa loves Para makakuha ulit ako ng Anyway, dahan salamat sa yung tanan. Pag amping mo tanan, it's summer. Enjoy the summer, guys. Dito sa Canada, yung mananjan sa Pilipinas. Enjoy nyo rin ang summer. Dahan kisalamat sa yung tanan. Pag amping mo tanan, keep safe and I will keep on trucking.